Brad was a very special case. Um, and um, his wife, Mandra, and uh, both of their families, um, he was very, very sick. He was, uh, he was on the brink of death um, more than once. Um, he's actually a miracle that he's alive. It's really uh, quite a thing. And as far as Mandra goes, um, Mandra was a really important piece of Brad getting better. Um, I will say the cardiovascular center here, because of the private rooms, because of the ability to have her kind of stay and um, give him the, the support and the encouragement he needed to, to heal, um, she, was, she was as much a part of his treatment to get better as all of the medicine and all of the care we gave him. I see my role as an advocate for someone that can't speak or know the lingo or, you know, you're very frightened, you have no idea what the circumstances are and even the language or how to manage. And next thing you know, if you have somebody that can kind of run you through the ropes and speak for you, then um, it brings your anxiety down and you're able to um, get on board with the plan, um, become part of the plan. And I think for Mandra, I always, we always talked about what we thought the plan for the day for Brad should be. And, um, and we basically got the team on board with what we thought because we knew him so well and we knew what he was capable of doing. In the uh, Shapiro Cardiovascular Center, um, it's brand new. We have the best and the latest technology and uh, it's wonderful. Um, but I always try to see the patient underneath all that technology. With the Family Centered Nursing and the families being involved, we always know there's a person with a history there, and, um, and that's important. Six months after he got out of the hospital, we met um, right around Christmas time, and uh, he had put a little bit of weight on. We entered a restaurant, and they wanted us to go upstairs, and I looked at him because he could hardly walk when he left the hospital. And he's like, no problem and he climbs the stairs, it was things like that. It was just amazing um, to see him and see both of them and um, to know that you know they, he was getting on with his life again. I love um, meeting someone different every day and, um, and maybe making one of their worst days a little bit better. That's really what I love to do.